improvements, really nothing much except for two items which I want you to pay some attention to. And these are something called construction work in progress. What might that be? What does it mean by construction work in progress? Yeah. Okay, so you've started building, a, let's say you're building a facility, and while it's being constructed, you're capitalizing that portion, right? And how about infrastructure? What is that? That's also unique to governments, infrastructure. What could infrastructure be? These are long, very long-lived assets, roads, sidewalks, things which you know, seem to last forever, but you know, they have to be maintained. But obviously, uh, the point here is that uh, they have very, very long lives. So those are two interesting pieces uh, that come to mind. How about land? Uh, what's so unique about land that you learned? Well, you don't depreciate land. Though what you'll find out in governments is there is one area where we depreciate land. And if you can tell me that, you don't have to take the exam. <laughs> the, question. the question is, when is the one time when you depreciate land? You know what? Should I let him off the exam? Yeah, you should. Actually, that's a very, what's your name, by the way? Justin, okay. So we have to put some extra stars. Okay. <laughs> Actually, it's a landfill itself. What you do is you you know you're 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 close. In fact, you're almost right there. What it is is that if you have a landfill and you're putting waste in it, basically you are using up its capacity, and therefore we don't call it depreciation as much as amortization of that landfill space, which we'll learn about. Now, the next thing which I want to uh, talk to you about is um, how do governments build these very large facilities? What's the process? Do they have cash sitting in the bank that they go out and just say, okay, here's some cash, let's go build? What do they normally do? They, yeah, what do they do? They, they go out and borrow money, right? And, or as they bond. So that's one thing that you have to remember, is how do governments finance their capital assets? And that's, by the way, the next half of this class, okay? So this is the, uh, we'll talk more about this. This is how governments finance general capital assets. They finance them through bonds, grants from the federal government or state government, transfer from other funds, gifts, and special assessment bonds or taxes. For the most part, it's really the tax-supported bonds which finance construction. 